Kit Fisher's DNA matches yours. Kel Surprise. I'm sure whenever that lab technician peered through the microscope, he saw whatever Kit Fisher paid him to see. Erica, Jake Martin oversaw that test personally, okay? Jake Martin. Not to mention, there was no one for Kit to swap the results with. Unless she found somebody whose genetic map was the same as Jackson's, which is impossible. The test is conclusive. Kit is Christine Montgomery. to be this con artist and a, an ordinary tramp. You have no idea how wrong you are. No, Jack, I'm not wrong. This is my sister we're talking about. My sister, Erica. My sister okay. was raped. OK, all right, Jack. Let's just say for argument's sake that the DNA test is foolproof, and that Kit Fisher really is your sister, Christine. Jack, I'm sorry, but that doesn't change the fact that she is a liar and a con artist and a con ordinary tramp. Erica, just watch your mouth. And I'm sorry if, if the truth is painful, but a little bit of pain now will certainly prevent tons of heartache down the road. What? What gives you the right to judge her? Me? I'm not judging her. She has a record. And what she did tonight is disgusting and demeaning, and it's an insult to the thousands of women in this world who really, really have been raped. And what has she done, exactly? Oh, Jack, come on. Do I have to spell it out? Yes. Kit Fisher decided that she wanted to cruise guys, so she went to this seedy tavern, and then she got plastered, and she came on to some low-life guy, and... She met him in the parking lot for a quickie, and she passed out. And when she came to, she realized that she was lying there, discarded like a piece of trash that she is, and she decided to cry rape, to get everybody to feel sorry for her. Look, Jack, rape is... It's a really horrible act of violence, and, and no woman should ever have to endure that. But Kit Fisher wasn't raped. Excuse me. Why don't you help me escort this woman out of here before she contaminates Kit with this garbage? Oh, I don't believe that. Look, that won't be necessary. I understand. You really hate the message, so you want to kill the messenger. But I'm telling you the truth, whether you like it or not. Okay. And I guess I'll just have to prove it. What the hell do you think you're doing? 